Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to fix Path of Exile 2 if it's crashing, all right? Well, the first thing that you need to check here is the game's graphical settings. You might want to turn it to the lowest preset, all right? Go ahead and run the game, turn the uh, settings to low, everything to low, and save it, then play a game and check if it helps. If that's so work, just go ahead and open up your favorite browser and type in direct text and hit on enter. As you can see here, there's the ones from Microsoft, DirectX, and User Runtime Web Installer. Just go ahead and click on it. All right. And here's a big blue button right here. Click on it, and the download process will begin when you click on Save. Just go ahead and hit on Save and uh, run the installer from here. There will be a pop-up. Just click on Yes, and follow the simple prompts from here. All right. I'm not going to install it again as I have already installed it earlier. Just go ahead and follow the simple prompts. Once done, restart your computer, launch the game again, and see if it helps. Now, if that still won't work, you might want to update your graphics card drivers. To do so, if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, just go ahead and run the NVIDIA app or NVIDIA GeForce Experience. And if you have an Intel or AMD graphics card, just look it up online on how to install it or update your respective graphics drivers. All right. Going back to NVIDIA, just go ahead and go to the Drivers tab and make sure that you have installed the latest drivers from here. If you already have installed it before and you're still getting the problem, well, try to at least reinstall it from here. All right. Wait for the process to finish. Once done, again, restart your computer, launch the game again, and see if it helps. Now, if that still won't work, go to the uh, search bar right here and type in graphics. And the graphics settings will pop up. Just go ahead and click on it. All right. Make sure that hardware accelerated GPU scheduling is turned on. All right. Then go hit the browse button right here. Simply add your game. And the directory would be in program files x86, Steam, Steam apps, common, here in common, and Path of Exile folder will be here. Just go ahead and open it up and add your game. Once you click on add, it will be landed to this particular section right here. Just click on the app, all right, and go to options and make sure that it is set to high performance. Once done, hit on save. Don't launch the game yet. Click on the back button right here, all right, and look for game mode. Click on this one right here, game mode settings. Make sure that it is turned on. Once done, go to the left pane again and, and hit on game bar. Make sure that it is turned off. All right, once done, close this one. Don't launch the game yet. Open up your Steam app. Go to the Steam icon right here at the top left. Go to settings and then go to in game. Make sure that a Steam overlay while in game is turned off. Then don't launch the game yet. Go to the Downloads tab right here, click Clear Download Cache right here, and wait for the process to finish, all right? Once it's done, close this one, locate the game, right-click on it, hit on Properties, go to Install Files, and simply hit on Verify Integrity of Game Files, all right? Once done, close this one, play the game from here, and everything should work perfectly fine now. Now, what if that still won't work? Well, you might want to check the game's minimum system requirements, all right? When you go to the game's store page, the minimum requirement is listed here, all right? Go ahead and pause the video and read the minimum requirements from here. Now, if one of your hardware falls short in the list, well, unfortunately, the game will crash every time you play it, all right? Well, the best thing that you can do here is to upgrade your particular hardware or your computer. And that is it. I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.